Meghan Markle, once known for her role on the TV show Suits, is finding herself increasingly isolated from Hollywood's elite. It seems that many celebrities are avoiding her, reluctant to be seen with or associated with her. But what's behind this shift? Matthew Zadaro of the New York Post reported that at a recent women's business summit in the Hamptons, celebrities were notably keen to avoid being photographed with Meghan. The event, hosted by power broker Amy Griffin, saw Meghan mingling with fashion designer Misha Nanyu and makeup mogul Bobby Brown. Despite this, notable attendees like Gwyneth Paltrow, Reese Witherspoon, and Diane Sawyer were conspicuously absent from any photos with her. An insider explained to the outlet that celebrities are wary of appearing in photos with Meghan, as it might be perceived as tacit approval she could use to promote herself. They know that if they're in a picture with Meghan, it's a tacit approval of her that she can use to promote herself, the insider said. Meghan might attend events where these celebrities are present and move into their neighborhoods, but they remain cautious of forming friendships. Sources suggest this avoidance points to a deeper issue. Many in Hollywood view Meghan as an unpleasant, social climbing figure with little real talent who uses people to advance their own agenda. They see her as lacking the hard work and charisma typically required to achieve celebrity status. Hollywood elites, who have earned their place through talent and perseverance, find Meghan's presumptive nature off putting. They are wary of her behavior, particularly her connections to the British royal family, and believe she uses people as tools rather than forming genuine connections. Celebrities also avoid Meghan to protect their own reputations. While a single photograph with her might not cause immediate damage, they see no benefit in risking their image by associating with her. They don't want to appear to endorse her or let her leverage their fame for her own gain. Meghan's tendency to claim connections with more famous individuals to boost her status is well known. For instance, she might suggest a friendship with someone like Cameron Diaz simply because they were photographed in the same vicinity. Meghan's narcissism leads her to believe that she is loved and admired by all, a delusion not shared by those around her. She is likely surprised by the lack of interest from celebrities who are not eager to be photographed with her. This absence of high-profile involvement wounds her ego and conflicts with her self-perception of belonging in the elite circle. The summit, which Meghan attended with entrepreneur Jamie Kern Lima, was intended to be a networking opportunity for female founders. Held at Griffin's $13 million estate, the event featured prominent figures like Weight Watcher CEO C.A. Sistani, Spanx founder Sarah Blakely, and cosmetics guru Victoria Jackson. Despite this impressive guest list, Meghan's attempts to ingratiate herself with these influencers seem to fall flat. Meghan Markle's growing isolation from Hollywood's elite highlights the challenges she faces in her post-royal life. Her perceived lack of talent, social climbing tendencies, and narcissism contribute to the aversion from celebrities. This growing distance underscores the reality that her delusions of grandeur and expectations of acceptance clash with how she is actually perceived by those she wishes to associate with. This disconnect is likely to remain a significant hurdle for her moving forward.